The Columbus City Council is honoring the life of Dorothy Cage Evans, a life that was taken too soon. Good evening, I'm Danielle Vittable. Her 82 year old husband is now behind bars accused of killing her inside the couple's home. She was a well known philanthropist here in central Ohio. NBC4's Eric Halperin is live outside City Hall tonight and Eric, this city plans to recognize all the work she did for our area. Yeah, Danielle, city council members are honoring her life and legacy with a special resolution. They presented that resolution to some of her family members at their church this morning. When you read through that resolution, you can see just how much she's done for the community, from helping to start Greater Columbus Community Helping Hands, to creating a scholarship fund, to being the food pantry coordinator at her church, and that is just some of the work. Giving this resolution to her family is the city council's way of saying thank you. City Council President Shannon Harden first met Cage Evans when he was in high school. He says she was a giant in this community and will be especially remembered for how caring she was. Cared for people, cared for uh, the community, um, who always had open arms uh, to give you a hug whenever you saw her. Um, she was a staple of our community. And Harden says they don't give out resolutions like this very often, but they wanted to make sure that Cage Evans' family knows how much her work is appreciated. Live and local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4.